제 54회 한번 갈아타야 돼요. Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Speak Korean. I'm your host Lisa Kelly and welcome to a fantastic lesson. Right, welcome to Let's Speak Korean. I am your Hunjang Kim Young and are you ready to get it on? 안녕하세요. I'm Blake and uh, I thought I looked pretty good today. Huh? I've got this nice shirt on and feeling buff. All right, you all fantastic. look very handsome. And here is our lesson for today. 하이 에브리온 <웃음> 안녕하세요 오제 오중혁입니다 눈물이 되는 눈물이 울고 있는 널 보면서 닦아보고 또 닦아봐도 그저 한숨만 토해내고 가슴이 내 가슴이 그댈 기억할까봐 돌아서는 너의 걸음을 그냥 그 네, 오늘 여러분들과 함께 공부할 내용은 한번 갈아타야 돼요 입니다. 한번 갈아타야 돼요. 한 번에 갈수 있어요? 아니요. 한번 갈아타야 돼요. 리사, 훈자님. Can we maybe it's so beautiful. Can we have class outside today? Oh, actually, that sounds like a pretty good idea. How about we go over to Nandaemun? That sounds good. Let's uh, take a trip over there. I mean, it won't take long by subway, right? Oh, wait a minute. Don't we have to exchange? Han bone gal su isseo? Han bone gal su isseo? I'm not so sure. Uh... Wait, 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 wait. wait. Han bone is, is one time. Right? Um, we weren't that before. But... I'm glad to see you're putting the pieces together in your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. take it away. Yeah. All right, uh, remember that little phrase. 한번 가봤어요. 한번 가봤어요. I've been there once. That's where you've heard that phrase. Now, 한 번에 갈수 있어요. 한 번에 갈수 있어요. Well, 한번 is once, and 갈수 있어요 is can you get there by one trip or one ride. So, 한 번에 갈수 있어요. So, this would refer to when you're either taking the bus or the subway or something like that, right? Because uh, you transfer lines every now and then when you're on the subway or when you're on the bus. Now, uh, basically this is, can you go without transferring? Right. Uh -oh. 한 번에 uh, was just explained in one trip. Now, this doesn't really translate into the English language, but you can think of it like this. Without transferring, without taking any stops, without converting to another form of transportation. So, it's in one straight shot, okay? We can get there very easily. Oh, that is awesome. That's exactly what, what I was going to say. It's in one straight shot or mm -hmm. one bang, okay? Uh, 한 번에 갈수 있어요? Can, right. you go, can you get there in one bang? All right, and be careful. You must, this is very important, you must have the e after 한 번에. Okay, 한 번 is one time e, 한 번에. And you pronounce it 네, not e, because of the 받침, the second consonant under 한 번. Okay, 한 번에 갈수 있어요? Because if you didn't put in the e, it means something different, which we'll get to in just a moment. Now, keep in mind, including the 한 번에 in this sentence. Uh, 한 번에 갈수 있어요? Can you go in one shot, one bang? Can you go without transferring? And the answer was 아니요, 한번 갈아타야 돼요. No, you have to transfer. 갈아타다 is the verb for 갈아 is to change and 타다 is to ride. So change and ride, which basically is transfer. Mm -hmm. 한번 갈아타야 돼요. Blank a oya deo. When you say all blank oya deo, that means you must do something. You should do something. Uh, you ought to do something. So it's not a command, but it's a, it's a strong suggestion. Blank. You should do something. And here it's kara ta a ya deo. For the all, you would use it for uh, verbs such as mokta. So depending on the verb and your pachim, then or the last consonant, you would use either a or o ya teo. Say it once for me. Karataya deo. Karataya deo. Mogo ya deo. Mogo ya deo. If I said mogo ya deo, mogo ya deo, what would it mean? I have to eat. You have to eat it. You should 
definitely, or you must eat it. Uh, what about uh, going? I have to be going now. I have to be leaving now. 지금 가야 돼요. I have to go now. 지금 가야 돼요. Try it. 지금 가야 돼요. You know, 지금? in fact, I do have to go. No, 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 no. not yet. Because oh. first, you have to study. What? The verb for study is 공부. And then you have to put the uh, verb part, in the stem, after it. So it's 공부해야 돼요. 지금 공부해야 돼요. That's the right thing. Oh. 지금 공부해야 돼요. I must study now. Or you, and now remember, there are two ways of saying this. If you're the person telling the, per, uh, the other person, you can say 지금 공부해야 돼요. That means, hey, you need to study now. But you can also say it to yourself, 지금 공부해야 돼요. And that means you're telling someone else, I'm sorry, I have to study now. Why? Because we don't have a noun there. We're not saying 나 지금 or you, you know, I'm not saying me or you. So it works both ways depending on the situation. Okay? Like, 지금 공부해야 돼요. Yeah, 지금 공부해야 돼요. <laughs> Hmm, sound familiar? Well, let's get into it. One day, Kongji received an invitation to join a party, but her stepmother and Pachi gave her chores instead and went off to the party themselves. Kongji went to the party and had a ball. She had a great time. And it's kind of like a Cinderella story, don't you think? Well, there you go once again. You have to be a good person in morals and everything else. And one day, everything will come back to you. Blake, it's test time. Got now the say this spirit. in Korean. Can you get there without transferring? 한 번에 갈수 있어요? No, you have to transfer once. Ah, uh, 아니요, 한번 갈아타 갈아타라 돼요. What language are you speaking? 아니요, 한번 갈아타야 돼요. 갈아타야 돼요. Remember, there's a difference between 한번 or 한번에. That 에 must be in there to make this sentence complete, or else it means a totally different thing. 한번에 갈수 있어요? 아니요, 아니요, 아니요. No, we cannot. And this is a shortened form as well. 아니요, 한번 갈아타야 돼요. 한번 갈아타야 돼요. As you can see, 한번 here without the 에 means one time. 갈아타다 means to change uh, modes of transportation or transfer lines in this situation. All right, you guys, time's up and it means that we have to go. How do you say yep. it's time for us to go? 지금? 지금? 가야 돼요. 가야 돼요. 지금 가야 돼요. But don't forget, 공부해야 돼요. You must study. Bye bye. Bye bye.